Speaking of dumb fuck shit for brains, by the way. So Kamala Harris has an idea. Now, you know, she's just spitballing here, right? She's not sure yet. She's just, you know, she's really ironing this out in her head. Now, again, let me check the calendar real quick. Oh, it's 2022. But Kamala Harris is not sure yet. Kamala Harris says, quote, probably by design that attacks on abortion, voting, and LGBTQ rights come from the same sources. Probably by design. We're not sure. It might be. But the jury is still out on this one. I know, I, I know. I should be saying, oh, well, at least she, you know, she's in the right direction, maybe. But, like... Vice President Harris on Monday said it was, quote, not by accident, but probably by design that the same sources who threaten abortion rights also work against voting rights and LGBTQ rights. Oh, you don't say. <laughs> you don't say, really. Harris made the remarks at a meeting she convened with civil rights and abortion rights activists. Attendees include blah, 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 blah. Certainly, we know that with the Supreme Court having made the decision in Dobbs to take a constitutional right that had been recognized from people in America from the women of America created a health care crisis in America. How many times are you going to say fucking America? Jesus Christ. From the people of America, the women of America, health crisis in America. Harris said, referring to the June Supreme Court ruling striking down federal abortion protections. I also want to mention that it is certainly, we think, we think, <laughs> we're not sure. It is certainly, we think, not by accident, but probably by design, that we are seeing from some of the same sources attacks on women's health rights, voting rights, LGBTQ rights, and we also stand here in full acknowledgement of what has taken place in our country. So, one end, we're not sure, but we think. On the other end, we're fully acknowledging what's going on. Harris has taken on the role within the Biden administration of pushing back against threats to abortion rights since the Supreme Court struck down Roe v. Wade to in her assertion that the Supreme Court caused a health care crisis in America comes just days after she made more pointed remarks about the highest court in the U.S. Harris referred to the Supreme Court as an activist court. Now, again, the Supreme Court being an activist court is not the problem. It's the fact that the activism is from fascists that want to destroy the country. That's the problem. If there was an activist court trying to explain, uh, expand voting rights, that's not a problem. If there was an activist court that was trying to end racism, end other forms of bigotry, that is not a problem, okay? The activism is not the problem. It's the fact that they are neo-Nazis. That's the problem. The reproductive rights leaders who gathered on Monday echoed Harris's uh, sentiments. Tens of millions of women, trans men, and non-binary people cannot access the care they need in their communities. And those that are most affected are those that, who are already facing barriers to care. Black, Latinx, indigenous communities, rural communities, immigrant communities. McGill Johnson from Planned Parenthood said at the meeting. So anyway, I don't know. I think I should probably take the win, you know. But for me, like, I just... You know, like, can we stop with this fucking shit? You know what I mean? Like, can we stop with this fucking, I think, we're not sure? Like, motherfucker, you're the vice fucking president. You're the vice fucking president. You have access to more information than anyone else in the country. And you're still playing patty cake. Oh, we're not sure. We're not sure. Um, it might be, uh, but we don't know yet. Um, I don't know, man. Like, I'm sick of this shit. Please, please, for the love of God, for the love of God, just state the fucking problem. That's like, it's like, okay, imagine in a hurricane, Kamala Harris would be like, oh, well, we're really not sure. I mean, we're kind of facing some high winds, like, like trees are being uprooted and flying through the sky. Kamala Harris is like, oh, well... You know, it's it's probably going to be a hurricane, but we're not really sure yet. There's motherfucking, like, you know, like, semi-trucks swirling in the fucking skies. Uh, you know, I mean, it is kind of rainy outside, so I don't know. There really might... 
anyway. So I guess I'll take the win, but uh, fuck.